7 Central on NBC. Perhaps right now, or at least sometime in your life, most of us have experienced back pain. In fact, the estimates are something like 80% of us over the course of our lifetime will have some pretty severe back pain. So the question is, what do you do? Where do you go to get treatment? And how soon do you go knock on someone's door? Where well, we're knocking for you this morning because we're talking with Brandy Parker. Uh, she is a physical therapist with the Center for Sports Medicine right here in Chattanooga. And she says she's the one ready to help you feel better hopefully pretty quickly so good to see you this morning brandy good morning thanks for having me on the show i guess the most important thing and the reason i said about knocking on the door is that anybody can give you a call tennessee is a direct access state which means you don't have to go through a physician to get to you in physical therapy correct many people still have the mindset that they have to see a physician or a surgeon before going to physical therapy but this is not true it is safe to see a PT first and is often much easier and quicker to get in for a spine PT evaluation and start seeing pain relief right away. So one thing, well, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you, but one thing that I know you're going to want to point out, at least I think you should, is that though you are a physical therapist, you're also a spine therapist. And that's really important to point out to people because you want someone who has that direct knowledge of your spine. Correct. So PTs are highly trained and educated to see spine. We have in-depth knowledge of body mechanics or in other words, how the body moves and their musculoskeletal system, which is kind of a fancy way of saying how our joints and our muscles work to allow movement. So we have a variety of hands-on manual therapy techniques to relax muscles, restore joint movement and retrain the body how to move correctly. So, you know, being movement experts allows us to give a custom exercise program to help you get back on track to do the things that you want to do and patient education is a big part of what we do as pts and so physical therapists can help you understand your pain make a plan to treat the pain and guide you back to the activities you want to do okay so part of the advantage though in coming to you at center for sports medicine is that of course the hope for everybody who comes through to see you i'm guessing is that you can non-invasively treat and hopefully cure that pain. But if there is a need for more intervention, you've got the doctors and surgeons right there at your disposal, right? Correct, we have a team approach where we can perform in-house uh, x-rays and MRIs. Our spine team at the center includes a close collaborations of physicians, physician extenders, and multiple PTs. If the exam indicates that therapy isn't the right approach, your therapist will use this team collaboration to reach out to one of the physician or physician extenders to get those concerns addressed quickly. Okay, let's talk about when people contact you. I'm guessing the earlier someone comes, the more likely they are to see a full recovery. You don't wanna let that pain get too severe. Correct. Early intervention, I think, is key. And, you know, as you said earlier, back and neck pain is perhaps one of the most common types of pain. And this type of pain interferes with every aspect of our life, from work to school to sports to hobbies and kind of even playing with our kids and grandkids. So we want to get in there and start a, a full musculoskeletal evaluation, looking at things such as posture, mobility, strength, and discuss what day-to-day -day activities are limited due to your pain. And we want to be able to get you moving better and help you get back to the things you enjoy doing in life because at the center we do recognize that life happens in motion. Okay, let me ask you this one because obviously if you're watching right now and you've got shoulder pain or neck pain or, or lower back pain, that's pretty obvious the, the area of your body to be addressed. But isn't it possible that sometimes you could have some leg pain, maybe even some arm pain, and that could be the result of a spine issue? Correct. So the, the spine can refer down our arms or our legs with things like numbness, tingling, kind of that lightning bolt tingling type of pain. So it, it, it can be localized right there at the spine or it can, it can refer to other body parts. And with you and physical therapy, are you going to be treating specifically muscle or, and ligament issues? Or if it is a nerve issue, can you help with that also? We treat all of it. We recognize that it, it can be any of those symptoms from the spine and we're, we're going to address what we see and, and take care of you. Okay, so um, in terms of coming in to see you, you are specifically at the Macaulay Avenue location, correct? 
I am in the Macaulay Avenue location. We do have multiple PTs that are specific on our spine team. So there are multiple locations that are available to you. And I know you can't speak to every case. Each person is individual when they walk through that door. But as a general rule, does it seem to uh, help a lot of people avoid surgery, beginning with the physical therapy? I believe so. Early intervention is key. So I think coming in here and correcting some of those errors in our body mechanics and how we're moving uh, definitely increases the odds. And, and one thing about it, unfortunately, it's not going to help everybody, but I still encourage you to come if you're sitting at home and think, well, you know, I need surgery and I've got to see a surgeon first because most insurances will require you to have therapy prior to having a surgery. Um, so getting in here quickly will decrease the odd that surgeries needed. And you know what, something else I've learned over the years on that insurance point, I'm glad you brought that up, is that we are this direct access state. So uh, most insurance companies have a limit though on how many physical therapy appointments they will cover. So that again speaks to the power of coming in earlier and that way you're really maximizing your power with those sessions and not having to drag it out longer than needed. Correct, and you know, not everybody has insurance, so we do cash pay services as well, um, so. That's a good point. All right, well, thank you so much for your time, Brandy. Let me show people how they can get in touch with you at the Center for Sports Medicine. If you want Brandy specifically, she's at the Macaulay Avenue location. 624-2696 is the phone number online. It is sportmed.com. Every Monday, as you know, we bring you the dad joke of the week, and this Monday is no exception. I'm sure plenty of you heard some pretty corny jokes over the Thanksgiving weekend. Here's our good friend Jason with today's funny. Your dad joke of the week brought to you by Scenic City Neurotherapy. Everyone deserves a laugh. Hi there, and welcome back for this week's installment of the Dad Joke of the Week. I think everybody's heard of Murphy's Law. 